getting comfortably seated with eyes gently closed, making sure the awareness is first on the hips, which are rested on the yoga mat, and then the vertebral column, and then the shoulders, gently tucked back, back of the head in line with the spine. Eyes continue to be gently closed. Come into a gentle chin lock now. And then do alternate nostril kapal bhati, right hand in nasagraha mudra, index finger, middle finger at the thumb joint. In the chin lock, which is called jalandar band, we come into peak state doing alternate nostril kapal bhati, which means we're going to do active exhalations from alternate nostrils, pulling our abdomen in at every nostril in jalandar band to come into peak state. Make sure you stay in chin lock when you're doing it. Make sure you're rhythmic in your exhalations. This is in preparation to yogic practices of meditation. For inner silence. For peace. If it is structured beautifully, it has to be a very intelligent structuring. Chin lock is called Jalandar Band. In Jalandar Band, it is one of the three locks. We come into a tight chin lock. Head is completely dropped. Every exhalation of Kapal Bhati will pull the abdomen in. It is alternated for now. Kapal Bhati with alternate nostrils in Jalandar Band has no contraindications. Discontinue the practice. Come out of Jalandar Band. Bring the hand down. Practicing Udyan Band. Those who have menstrual cycles, those who are pregnant, those who have any hernia condition in the umbilicus or the abdomen will not do Udyan Band. They will do Mool Band instead. Udyan Band is an abdominal lock. Mool band is a lock between the anus and the urethra. So the contraindications person, people, patrons, students will not do Udyan band if they are pregnant, if they have their menstrual cycles, or if they have a hernia, an umbilical hernia or hernia in the abdomen. Others can practice. Inhale fully. Inflate the abdomen like a balloon. Exhale completely. Bring the abdomen in. So this is an abdominal lock. It's called Udyan Band. Those who have a contraindication of the same will come into Mool Band. Inhale fully. Mm -hmm. Inflate the abdomen. Exhale completely. Come into Mool Band. Lock the perineum. Restart alternate nostril kapal bhati.
in Udyan Band, there's already a law. So Kapal Bhati won't show much movement. While doing this passive, inhalations are happening. You don't have to make an attempt to inhale. Discontinue the practice, release the Udyan Band or the Mool Band. Now combine the two Jalandar Band, Udyan Band or Jalandar Band, Mool Band. Inhale fully, inflate the abdomen like a balloon. Exhaling, come into the two locks. Jalandar band, neck lock, chin lock. And Udyan or Mool band. Kapal Bhatis now start counting from 108 in a descending order. On finishing 108 Kapal Bhatis counted in descending order. Kapal Bhatis being exhalations, active exhalations pulling the abdomen in. The passive exhalations happen on their own. Discontinue all practices, remove the locks. Come back to normalcy, don't do any pranayam. Just watch yourselves. Continue keeping a very intensified awareness. At this point, turn the tongue tip inside so that the bottom of the tongue is pressing up on the heart palate and the tip of the tongue is all the way inside in the throat.
Now, in Kejri Mudra, inhale fully, lift the head up. Hold the inhalation up there. Come into a chin lock, Jalandar Band. Exhaling. Come back from Jalandar Band. Open your eyes and look cockeyed. Look completely cockeyed at the eyebrow center. Sambhavi Mudra. Sambhavi Mudra is called eyebrow gazing. Sambhavi Mudra itself has innumerable benefits. Sambhavi Mudra is eye yoga. It cures dryness, tiredness, under eye circles, macular degeneration, myopia. But just now we are into meditation mode. So please I don't want to distract you all by mentioning each one's innumerable benefits. It's only for someone who does not understand Sambhavi Mudra. Open your eyes to watch me. Otherwise, stay there. Eyebrow gaze. We all know where the eyebrow is, right? We have to gaze at the center of it. Once you come back from it, your eyeballs, eyes may hurt a little. You don't have to look at the nose. You don't have to look at the ceiling. You have to look at your eyebrow center, Sambhavi Mudra. Some of us may get a little dizziness in what is going to happen next. But with lot of practice, with regular practice, that will also wear away. To rediscover how powerful you are and to come out stronger, you have to know the distance between the life you want to lead and the life, the dream life that you want to lead and the life you're living now. I'm slowly making that possible for each one of us. Myself included. For that, you are just one decision away. The decision to log in every morning 7.30 to 8.05. Come out of the eyebrow gaze. It's called Sambhavi Mudra. We now do all four together. We inhale fully, inflate the abdomen like a balloon. We exhale completely and come into Jalandar Band and or, which means either of the two, Udyan Band or Mool Band. We do this while inhaling fully. Lifting the head up in Sambhavi Mudra along with Kechari Mudra. Let's begin. First, tongue inside all the way. Kechari Mudra. Kechari is an important Amrit Ras, a fermented one, which if goes from the fontanel to the tongue tip, they say, You've achieved that ultimate state of enlightenment and samadhi. Can happen in a moment or can take innumerable births. The base of the tongue is on the top heart palate. We then come at the eyebrow gaze. We then inhale, lift our head up and then drop it back. In an eyebrow gaze in Sambhavi Mudra. 
the locks have not happened yet. Exhaling, we come into Jalandar Band. Eyebrow gaze is still there. Sambhavi Mudra, Kechari Mudra. As you come into Jalandar Band and the second lock, Udyan Band, abdominal lock. No pranayam should be done here. Those who can't do Udyan Band, pregnant, period, menstrual cycles, monthly cycle and hernia in the umbilicus. We'll do mool band. Here, don't hold the exhalation. Breathe normally. Come out completely. Release the lower log, release the Jalandar Band, release the Kechri Mudra, release the Sambhavi Mudra. First step. Tongue, tip all the way in, Kechri Mudra. Base of the tongue pressing on the heart palate. Then eyes cockeyed. Look at eyebrow center. So you're doing two things. Kechri mudra and Sambhavi mudra. With a combination of both the mudras, we look, we drop our head back. If our eyeballs were normal, currently they are in a mudra, how would we look if you want to look up at the ceiling, that's the way you have to drop your head back. After the next inhalation, come into a chin lock, exhaling. Iske baad wale saas par saas jab aap inhale karoge saas loge. Uske baad saas chhodte huwe. Dheere se jalandar band mein aaye. Kechri mudra and sambhavi mudra stay. And now come into abdominal lock called Udyan Band or or is very important hernia conditions, menstrual people uh, maternity people will not do this they will do it Mool Band come into that second lock When you did a Jalandar Band, you exhaled. So now you have to continue breathing normally in a throat rub. Inhale, inhales and exhales are in Ujjayi. Don't hold your breath. Continue breathing in Ujjayi. At this point, check if any one of the two locks has opened up, which means check if you've lifted your head or check if the mool or Udyan Band has opened up and come into it tighter. We are currently doing four things. Kechri Mudra, tongue tip behind. Sambhavi Mudra, eyeballs gazing at eyebrow center. Jalandar Band, chin lock. And one more lower lock. 
उद्यान बंद और मूल बंद एंड वी आर ब्रीदिंग नॉर्मली इन उज्जय थ्रोट ब्रेथ आर इनहेलेशन एंड एक्सिलेशन आर रबिंग इन द थ्रोट पिट This is a very advanced technique, friends. Some of us can have eye pain after coming out because we've never exercised our eyes so much. Some of us can have a shoulder catch. Shoulders may hurt a little. Very deep meditative state is what it can get us into. and breathing has not stopped breathing is normal at the most one of the locks or one of the mudras can open up at the most the udyan band or mool band will open up or the jalandhar band will open up and you may lift your head no problem get into it again or at the most one of the two mudras may open up the kechri mudra or the sambhavi mudra which means your tongue may come back to normal or your eyeballs may come back to normal no problem ujjay continues slowly come back inhaling come out of jalandhar band release the udyan or mool band release the sambhavi mudra that is the eyebrow gaze release the kechri mudra that is bring the tongue back get ready to end your session by doing a good round of palming another very important eye energizer rab 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 produce your pranic energies do palming if you have some time rest your elbows on your dining table or somewhere on a bolster and continue for 2 3 minutes if not just open and close your eyes in darkness and slowly open your eyes and rise thank you and hari om tat sat thank you for being a part of today's session thank you for helping me live my mission by just showing up by helping me fulfill my vision thank you all